Hello, this is Alan from Toolchef. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use USD asset to define uh, an agent type inside an animation clip and use inside a simulation. So let's open the Atom UI. Uh, now let's delete uh, the man since I export the man as USD. Let's create a new and then let's point to the USD file that we exported before and uh, let's point us to the skin and let's register now let's have a look to the skin as well and it's there uh, so for for the usd file here uh, you can specify also a specific primitive inside this file uh, from the path here so for example uh, if i want just uh, use the body of my of my agent and not all the clothes as well i can put the primitive part of my body here um, so let's have a look first to the part of the body and go to the man skin and then my body is here so it's the man skin and then body geo so let's go back to udini and then here I can use that and then specify the part of my my body geo. If I register now, I have all the body. If you have if you want to select a variant set, uh, you can use the standard USD convention. So for example, if you have a variant set called variation. Uh, with the variant called a man A, you can do like this to select this uh, that, that specific variant. And you can do this uh, on all the uh, fields that accept a USD file, so you can do on the skin, the skeleton, and on the variation table as well. So let's remove this one that I don't need. Let's register, okay. Uh, let's change the name to man. Now let's go to the animation clip because we export us an animation clip as USD. Uh, let's take our man walk. Uh, you don't see the skeleton because that uh, USD file contains only the skeleton animation, does not contain the skeleton. So I just need to set up the compatible agent type. And let's put the static register. Have the skeleton on there. Uh, let's recompute the foot down data. and the ground is already computed inside the clip. So I can register, and now let's test our, uh, our clip. Create a new agent group, and then let's go to the agent group, create a grid layout, and I have already my man. Let's see if the skin works. So it's there, everything works fine. Let's have a look to the uh, animation clip, go to the clip reader, attach it, and then select the animation clip that we just created. So it's there. So it works fine. Now let's create a couple more agents and uh, let's import the variation table we export as well. Uh, so let me create a couple more agents here. Uh, let's import the variation table. Variation, variation, let's import it. And then let's assign some variation. Now let's have a look, let's switch to the variation. And I have, we have the variation here, and the variation is table you use in the USD geometry. Here, yeah, and the ores using USD. So that's it. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.